how to crack process in TCS Wings 1. Hello friends, welcome back to Smart Nasir Tech Study. So in this video, we are going to discuss how to crack process, which is a non-technical track. So basically for you to get digital, you need to achieve a minimum pass in articulation and a domain certification, which is like a I1 course and a core programming, you need to get distinction. After that, you either you can choose with the process, business or new directives. So basically business articulation and process are non-technicals. So non-technicals are essential in our job responsibilities because they teach us how to perform our job in a good manner technicals makes our project resilient but process makes our project success so topics in process so basically there are only two topics in process first one is rayo regular in operation and another one is agile for practitioner so agile methodology most of the people are working in agile environments they have experience of agile practices as well scrum master scrum ceremonies like that things are there it is like a related to operations rio so topics in rio model basically there are two models in rio first one is rio foundation it's like a basic quiz and uh, another one is application operation competency awareness it is like a competency awareness related to operations so for you to complete RIO foundation course of this module one application operation team member quiz in Rio you have one prerequisite so prerequisite is writing an effective incident and outage notification quiz so you need to attend this quiz and get the 12 or 13 marks out of uh, 15 so 80 percent marks is required in this simple quiz so and another module is like writing an effective incident and outage notification this is a prerequisite you need to complete so in this you need to get 80 percent 15 questions are there in 15 questions the, the quiz contains a total of 20 questions of which any 15 will be displayed to the learner so 15 will be displayed in the questions so in the 15 you need to choose the you need to you should have to be correct 12 or above for you to pass this matter exam now we have to discuss exam pattern so number of questions are 40 so exam pattern is related to offline exam after completion of this IOL internal course so duration is one hour or 60 minutes pass marks here 50 percentile if you get 25 plus out of 40 you will get a jumps of rs 500 and if you are able to achieve 32 plus then you will get 70 percentile so there is a difference between percentage and percentile so in the description i will give you the video know that difference in that video and exam centers are obviously teachers and centers in your deputy branch now we have to discuss some important previous year questions or essential questions so writing an effect to incident and outage notification related to assessment uh, the business impact section of your incident notification specifies option a only specifies tasks that are that the users are unable to accomplish option b only the impact on business option c specific tasks that users are able to unable to accomplish and the impact on other models option d all of the above now it's time to see the right answer So right answer is specific tasks that the users are unable to accomplish and the impact on the models, impact on other models. So another question important one, it is best to use the stakeholders time zone in an incident notification. So this is the direct answer. Yes, it is true. True is the right answer. Question number four, an incident notification is sent out to all stakeholders only when there is a planned outage. So this is a false one. If there is an unplanned outage also, we have to send the incident notification to all relevant stakeholders. So here you have to send the false as the answer. Question number five. Yeah, an incident or outage notification provides the following information to stakeholders. So all the options are correct here. So what are the information is uh, inside in the notification? incident or outage notification impact of the disruption or outage on the availability of services or applications and update on the status of the issue and the expect time of resolution so all these options are right and valid answers question number six in an incident notification mentioning the time zone impacted is optional so this is a false one so you have to mention the time zone as well 
in an Asian organization. Question number seven. Action taken so far is listed. So, right answer is sequentially in reverse chronological order. Question number eight. A business impact statement must mention. So, it has to mention tasks or actions users cannot accomplish and impact on the business final one is impact on other models or aspects so here we have to select the all of the above as answer which is a right one question number nine the global employee self-service GESS application will not be available over the weekend due to maintenance activity hence the internal IT team plans to publish a communication through which through which will contain description of the maintenance activity impacted areas along with business impact and timelines this is a so this this is a planned outage notification. Question number 11. Techcom can help you to tech communication. Techcom is so it helps you to get your documentation and business communication first time right. Save yourself considerable time and effort on review and rework of documents. And the last one is delight your customer with quality of the documentation. So here you need to select the all of the above option. Question number 12 essential and important one there are multiple owners for an incident that needs to be resolved on priority whose name would you include in the incident notification so you need to include the names of all the incident managers so the wrong options are the key the key or prime owner of the incident and the primary and secondary owners so finally you have to set the, the names of all the incident managers as the right option question number 15 last one the company's erp system has suddenly come to a halt the incident management team is drafting a communication to be sent to all the relevant stakeholders immediately they have included about the occurrence of the disruption expected duration to resolve the incident expected outcome or effect of the disruption but they are not sure what status they should provide for business is identify the correct status of the business impact options are business impact will be assessed later assessed later business impact assessment is in progress so the right answer is business impact assessment is in progress incident team is the is the right option so if you have any elevate wings one related day, any doubts or queries you can book a session with me with the 99 rupees and if you want a wings one related day, complete a to jet coaching for one month you can choose this plan for three months same you have to select this one if you require tcs wings one materials basic plus uh, premier materials you have to choose this one for six months guidance you have to choose this plan total six months this price only carry related doubts or clarification book this one ask me anything which is 60 this is a query replies in two days this is a chart based question replies in two days if you require this top 50 plus important questions which is almost 60 important mcqs you have to go to our channel and click on join and take the wings one basic materials membership join and uh, after joining you will get that box and if you want to support our channel click this one and join if you require wings one premium both the basic and the non basic one you should have to select this plan so thanks for watching do like subscribe and share we shall meet in another super latest video if you need process important previous year questions or upcoming or uh, so if you need a process important previous year questions or important questions make a comment in the comment section we shall meet in another super latest video until then jai hind jai bharat